Welcome to this channel. We are paid to do absolutely nothing. We're not monetized, we're not promoted or anything like that. All we ask is if you can do a like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy the content of the video. And today's video, I really, really hope you enjoy because this is going to be something a little bit special. So on the screen here, you can see the Midnight Brew logo that has just disappeared and it says Frankenstein Rebooted. Well, this game comes from a very special package. Let me share a few more details with you so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. For Midnight Brew, there is a dual pack Frankenstein Rebooted and Dr. Acula. This is to celebrate the 40th anniversary of these games. This is a very, very limited quantity that you can get. So if you collect Spectrum games, this might be the package for you. Where you can get this will be in the video description below and also in the ticker that scrolls across at some point. And look at that eyes moving, look at that eyes moving, that's quite good. So this has got, I believe, some additional music by Lee B as well. Um, Midnight Brewer were involved in this, Colin Stewart created this game, and this is rather a good game. So we can turn the tunes on and off by hitting C on the keyboard. We're going to keep the one because I think they sound quite nice and we're going to be playing with the Kempston joystick. So, spooky season, let's build a monster. So S to start, and you're this guy at the top here. And what you got to do, you got to build a monster. So the head always comes first, then you go left, right, left, right. So the top part of the torso goes next, and then we've got to collect the bottom part of the torso. So if we go all the way along here, and we walk over that leg, we are not going to pick that up. But there's nasties, and there's things which are a challenge. So we've got a timer on the top of the screen. If that timer gets down to zero, um, we've essentially lost and we haven't built. And we've got to push that button at the top of the screen by the time um, that gets to zero. In fact, before that gets to zero. And we've got to build the monster before we do that. But we've got to avoid these monsters below. So we can fall off the platform and you land on stuff like ice that like lets you slip along. And I think it's a really cool sprite here. I really, really do. Um, but you can't jump. The only way you can go up is basically by hitting springs. You know, you can stand on the electric to get yourself electric, which you'd notice that pushes the timer up a little bit. And then we could try and collect that bit of the body, but we can't get to that. So we're a little bit stuck. We need to get to that spring effectively um, on the right hand side to jump up, but we've left it too late and we've gone the wrong way. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna walk down here. We're gonna run across here. Don't worry, we've got time as I try and describe very badly what is going on? We are going to jump up here, and yeah, dear Lord, all right, we might we might have a timing issue here. Let's see how well we can do. In fact, I know what we can do. We can walk across here. We can get electrocuted, and we can jump up by standing on that spring and pressing fire. Oh, he doesn't go all the way up. Balls, utter balls. All right, that went a little bit wrong. So two minutes 49, 48 going on. All right, let's go up here. I got that a bit wrong, didn't I? So jump up. Let the snake pass. Jump up. Run over here. Get the top bit of the body. And now, 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 this is going to be close timing. Oh, and I got caught. Balls. All right, so that went a little bit wrong, didn't it? Okay, it's been a while since I've played this. It has been a while since I've played this. All right, let's go down here. Let's go here. Let's walk there. Let's get that bit of the body. There you go. We've got one of his legs and the timer is still clicking down. So we're going to jump up here. We're going to use this spring over here. Jump up there. And we're basically going to go all the way to the left and get the lower parts of his hips and upper leg. And boom, there you go. We've got that. So that's perfect. That's perfect. You know, we're going to run across here. We're going to use this spring to go up. We're going to use this spring to go up here again, and we are going to go all the way across to the left and hopefully not lose any more lives. That was a stupid loss of life. Why did I do that? Because I made a mistake. And yes, I do make mistakes in games, um, probably more often than not. All right, so we've got one more bit of leg to get, but we cannot go up those stairs. All we can do is go down, and we are going to drop down here. And we are going to go all the way to the right. And look, we move faster than the monsters as well. So you've got to be a little bit careful. There are a lot of screens to this. And this pack, if you choose to get this pack, will have some other goodies in it as well. Like artwork and stuff like that. You are really buying something special to commemorate. 40 years of the Frankenstein uh, series of games with Dr. Acula as well. So we're going to jump up here and go across to here. And look, the time is nearly running out. But it's all right because we are awesome. No, we're going to go up here. We're not always awesome at games, but this I like to think we're okay at, even though I wrecked it and lost a life. All right, so we're going to push down the plunger, and the monster, the monster is going to be born. So level complete. 
So it wants us to press S to carry on, which we're doing. And now we've got a new challenge. So we've got uh, Frankenstein basically throwing balls at us, a little bit like Donkey Kong. And we've got to get to the top to push that plunger. So I'm going all the way across to here, aware of that monster there. You've also got to be careful when you jump up, because you watch him when he jumps up, he raises. We'll let that monster pass. In fact, no, we'll let that ball kind of pass. So that ball has got to get to the end. But right, watch this. Watch this when we jump. You jump one extra pixel high. And see this, I'm directly under that monster. So you've got to be a little bit careful of what you're doing here. Um, all right, so we're going to go here. Now, is that ball going to fall down that hole? No, it's not. All right, so we're going to jump up here. When that passes, boom. And then we're going to go and touch the J. And that is a teleport. So we go all the way here. Now we've got to time this perfectly. We've got to time this perfectly because we are going to be running all the way to the left. And we're also going to be electrocuted on our journey which is going to stop us walking so that basically freeze freezes us oh no 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 what killed me ha huh, i looked i looked across to the screen to my left on how i've got my setup and oh my god how did i die i can't believe i i screwed it up <laughs> all right i can't believe i screwed it up it's me all right jump i generally have got no idea what killed me now it must have been a second ball that appeared well, we're not going to get to that one on time. Damn it, damn it, damn it, Janet. All right, that was very carefully falling off in here. And look at this chaos. Yes, we just did it. But then we've got to, we've got to deal with these other balls now. Oh, 45 seconds. Oh, this has all gone wrong. Why did I get that wrong? I reckon I used the teleport wrong. I have no time. I have got no time. Yes, beep, beep, beep. And look at it flashing away at the top now. We will do better on the second game we have here. I think we're on our last life. But oh my God, by the beard of Christ, we have wrecked this. It will take some miracle. It will take some miracle to recover this. Right, slip on the ice. Run, 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 run. Can we get there in time for that, for that ball? No, we can't. And we can't run away in time either. Panic, panic, panic. Uh, two, one game over so that's not how to play this game i'm going to be better now so s to start again i will be so much better this time i absolutely promise you right we need we basically need that syringe to head back and we're going to drop down at the last minute in our pixel perfect play. There we go. Did you see that? That 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 was right on the money. And we're going to run all the way over here. Ah, oh, electrocuted. Oh, balls! <laughs> I was one pixel out. All right. Okay. Our perfect gameplay is maybe not so perfect, but am I having fun? Yes, I am. I hope you are. All right, cross back here. Get electrocuted. Watch that time go up. Okay, it looks like it's got a top level of three minutes where it can go to. Wait for this to cross. Can we do this? Yes, we can. Right. It's, a, it's good. This platform. There were, there were many platform games on the ZX Spectrum, but these Frankenstein ones were very, very good because they took the platform game. They took away um, one dynamic that existed on so many of them, which was jumping. And with, 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 with that removed, it actually meant that you had to be a bit more skillful on these games as you played them. Alright, so we are going to be alright. We're going to be absolutely fine as long as I don't do anything stupid. Alright, so it's a run here. Jump up. 
I can't believe I was like one pixel off perfection for doing that, but never mind. And sometimes on this game, as you get through the game, um, you've really, really got to take a deep look at what you're doing because it can get pretty damn hard. All right, let's push this plunger here. And there we go. Frankenstein has been down. Level complete. And we're going to start again. We are going to start again. All right, okay, this ball lake here. And look at this. I think the monsters change. So I don't think that was an arrow before. No, I reckon the monsters definitely, definitely do change. And look at this. We have got so much ice there. Right, okay. And, and, and some of the bad stuff is clearly changing here. We've got three rows of ice that we did not have before. Right, so jump. Yes. All right, we've got to do. We've got to worry about those two balls. We need to get to that electric thing to get more time as well. Okay, that survived that one. And we, got, in fact, we won't have to worry about four balls that are rolling down. Fifty-three seconds. All right. Okay, so after this ball, it's going to be a madcap run to that spring as we wait for the next ball. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Up we go. Come on. Actually, I'm inclined to try and... Oh, do we wait, do we wait? Yes, we wait. We have to wait. All right, he's dropped another ball as well, which is going to be a bit painful, so we need to jump up. Reset the timer by getting electrocuted just a little bit. Boom, there you go. Look at that. Glorious. All right, we've got green stuff that's going to slow us down. We've got to let this ball pass. And this is going to be close. Oh, no, damn it. That, that, that seesaw was in the way, which was a bit of a problem. All right, okay, pixel perfect four missed that. Oh, damn it. No pixel perfects there. And now we're dead. Now we're dead because of that ball coming rolling to us. Oh, this is ridiculous. I could be so much better at this game. Good Lord. All right. Off we go again. Off we go again. Right, let's complete this without dying. that slide down there run across here and get electrocuted oh where am I going where am I going I need to go this way oh I went the wrong way all right let's get the electrocution out of the way which will take that back to three minutes all right and I'm wondering I'm wondering all right we're gonna drop off here then we're gonna get the the bit at the bottom Have we got time to... Yes, we have got time to get it and get it back. So we're going to now have to drop down and follow that, that, that wheelie thing back. And then we use the springs to essentially recover from where we were. And by recover from where we were, uh, not get killed by that syringe there. Come on, come on. 217. This will be the perfect playthrough. Yeah, watch him. When, when he jumps up, he goes up literally one more pixel um, than, than, than what he needs to hit anything that's conveniently placed above. Okay, and again, we have to follow this yellow thing all the way back to the right. Now, remember... On the next screen, the first enemy that we would have on the, the first row was an arrow last time. And I'm absolutely certain that is changing. Uh, so let's keep an eye on And there was also that platform that had three ices as well. So yeah, let's keep a very close eye on what level two looks like as we get to it again. So right, up we go, up we go. And up we go here. And we are basically going to go and push that plunger. And there, level completes. Alright, so S to continue. 
and yeah, look at this. Look at this. All the ice is at the bottom now. That is not a uh, uh, an arrow. That's uh, God knows what the hell that is. You know, so we got these balls that we need to worry about. Back down there. We're going to have to do this again. And we're going to do a lot of freezing here. Because uh, we, we got one, two, three, four things that want to kill us. Alright, I'm going to try and get rid of that one there. No, we haven't got time to get rid of that. I nearly got caught being greedy there, didn't I? So back off this platform again. Thank you, Ice. I notice there's no green slime to slow us down here either. Jump up. Can I get to... No, I can't get to that one. I was looking to get to the electrocution point as well, just to obviously fix the problem that we've got. Now, this is going to be a little bit tight, I think, that... Okay, the seesaw is alright. The seesaw's done what I needed to do. Jump. Run. This is the one, this is the one, this is the one, I think. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, oh, that was close. That was, holy hell, that was close. What the, what, what, the balls got me there. I died there and I died there as well. Alright, okay, we got one life there. I absolutely want to get to the next screen. Alright, so jump. And because we can't jump over the, the, the balls, you're kind of stuck a little bit. This is going to be close with that seesaw. This is going to be a little bit close. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's good. All right. Right, wait here and turn. Go all the way here, and I'm watching very carefully this time. Okay, it's a bit horrible here with the electric that we've got. All right, let's get electrocuted very quickly. Oh, balls! A eh? god, it's the rat got me this time. Final go. Final go. This is addictive. It is addictive. But holy hell, you know, the, the randomness of, um, you know, some of the layouts makes it a little bit exciting. I'm sure that that, that second screen, you know, um, could give me an easier layout than what it does. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So let's grab this. Dr. Acula is more of the same. Dr. Acula is really, really good as well. But obviously, we're not playing this. We're only playing this one here. Um, all right, so we're going to jump up, grab that, okay, we'll get rid of that as well. Go down, jump up. Why did I do that? I don't know, because I can. Go down, run, 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 run. that there's nothing we can do here we can only go left all right 226 that's fine two bits of body to collect to build the guy that you can see on the left hand side of the screen who has just disappeared do you like my bats behind me as well i don't often use that bat one but yes i've used it this time right Come on, come on. 
you know what? You nearly saw me do a mistake there. I was looking at the wrong enemy and thinking, ah, you need to pass. I thought, no, 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 I don't need you to pass. I need to not be where I am. Well, will it pass sometime? Because we had to wait for that particular point where we were there anyway. But no, no jumping gives this game a, a slightly different experience. Right, there we go. A perfect first run. And then we can live in fear of what Screen 2 is going to give us. We have to beat it this time. We have got to beat it this time. Alright, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Right, so we press S to see what nightmare is in front of us. Oh, ice. Okay, ice is good. Okay, we've got the green slowing down bit as well. That rat thing above me uh, is moving so slow as well. All right, so we've got the two balls we got to navigate here. Three balls coming down. Down. I can't get to that electrocution point in time, so, you know, we've just got to do this. It's going to be a mad run, though, I think. And we die. We had no choice. We absolutely had no choice. And we got caught for Mother Mary. It. We're not going to make it. Yes, yeah, 30 seconds. Thank you for telling me. And we've got that slow ass rat thing as well. Alright, okay, 20 seconds. We might get it. We might get to the execution. Okay. And that snake thing there above, if you've ever played Scuba Dive, you'll recognize what that looks like. It's not the same one, but it is very, very similar. We are going to let that pass because we don't want to be jumping up and down. When's it going to turn? If I saw it, no time. Oh, and we died by the gods of Christ. One final go. One final go. I have to show you <laughs> the next screen. Obviously, my gameplay here, um, there, 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 there's, a, there's a bit of luck that's going on in terms of how that next screen has been laid out. But, oh, my God, you know... Uh, I, I'm not doing as well as what I believed I was going to be doing when I was playing this. You know, I thought, yeah, you yeah, know, this, 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 this game, this playthrough is going to be an absolute home run. You know, I have skills, home run, you know, all round. But no, clearly not. So what isn't random is the layout of the 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 body parts that you see here. That is not random. Well, you know what? We could probably get rid of that. We're doing this a slightly different way because I got rid of that electrical thing. But we will be alright. I believe it will be alright on the night. There's no TV show for you. It will be alright on the night. Alright, we've now got to wait for this to go back. But you knew that was going to happen anyway. Right. Let's grab that leg. 
Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, I should have walked off there. I should not have walked off there then. All right, down we go. He's thinking. He's sweating. You know, he's getting sack sweat worrying about what level two is going to look like. Right, get that bit of leg. What you can do, you can literally walk, which I've just realised, into the springs while holding the fire down, and it does it for you. Maybe if I'd done that a little bit earlier, um, then that pixel perfect stuff would have been pixel perfect. Okay, what is this? We got we got a syringe, we got spiders, we got an ant. Alright, look at this, he was taking a bit longer for, for, for that ball, so we could be alright. No, that one isn't going to be alright, that is so a oh, good lord. Right, we need quite a gap to cross um, that ice. Maybe this is going to be the one. Oh, balls, the ant was above me for the love of frig. Thirty seconds, and oh my god! I've just seen. We we can't do it. We cannot do this. There is no electric device. There's no way that I can get more time. Oh my god! Hang on a minute. What is this? You can jump on these levels. Oh my no! Oh my <laughs> no! All right, we're dead. All right, one more go, one more go. Right, start. Right. I can't jump, I can't jump. You see me doing this, you can see me doing that button there. And I'm gonna click that. And when I press that button there, I do jump. Oh, you can, oh my word. All right, we will definitely beat that level now. There was gonna be no more, that was gonna be it. But you know what, based on <laughs> Based on that I now have the power of jump. You know, did the game recode itself in the background? Of course it didn't. You know what, I've got a gut feeling that I've encountered that before. And I I, I, I forgot. Maybe I forgot. Yeah, let, let's pretend I forgot. Alright, okay. Unbelievable, unbelievable mistake. Unbelievable. I'm a bit annoying myself for that. You know, I, 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 I <laughs> I'm learning as you go. I'm learning as you go. But no, no jumpy, jumpy here. No, no, no. We're stuck on the platform because I had that little speech about how you, uh, you know, they've removed on the platform. They've removed the jumps, but no, clearly, clearly only partially removed the jumps. All right. Okay, let this thing go back then it's grab the leg grab the leg of the monster and then we do it again and then we will play level two with the power with the power of jumps Here we go. Nothing is going to stop us now. 
Right, let's carry on. Look at me jump. I am brilliant. Right, this is not going to be the, 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 the ball ache that it was before. Come to me, come to me, you ball. Oh, that teleporter nearly killed me there. Right, all I've got to be careful. Oh, no, I touched the pissing ice. Oh. I was going to say, all I had to be careful of was not jumping into a ball at the top. And then, no, 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 I do something completely different. Alright, okay. So I find new ways to kill myself that I hadn't previously found before. Oh god, 30 seconds. Unbelievable. gonna be close oh I can't do it twenty seconds Panic in the hills. And it's game over. And it is game over. Well, you know what? <laughs> I could probably play for hours and not get through this, but let's remind ourselves what we were playing. So this is the 40th anniversary collection of Frankenstein Rebooted, the game we played. Dr. Acula recently released um, at zero of your Earth Pounds from Colin Stewart. And this has been brought together into a wonderful package by Midnight Brew. I have had a lot of fun playing this. I truly, truly have. I had a look at Midnight Brew, the link below. And you know what? This is in very limited editions in terms of what they're doing. I'm not forcing you to buy, but I'm just making you aware that this is one of these things that it's going to be. If you are a Sinclair Spectrum collector, is buy it now before it's gone. Otherwise, you may never get it, and you may be paying outrageous, outrageous eBay prices for it. All of you stay safe. All of you take care, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Gentlemen's Pixel Club, the ultimate game channel on YouTube.